Welcome back. Time to end Fixmas today. We're going to start with a little tour, talk about some flashing lights, and then end with some fireworks. I hope you enjoy. Okay, so there's still one more thing I need to do to finish off Fixmas. I have been producing stars, and maybe about two per minute, I think. My original numbers didn't go as planned, so I had to make adjustments. And I was going to do like 1.2, but then I realized I overdid everything, so I could make two. So I have been storing them over here, and as you can see, I've been storing up a lot. So I think we need 500 to finish off Fixmas, so I'm going to go ahead and just snack those. So I'm gonna run back to our hub and research the last bit of Fixums so we can like take a look at the Christmas trees. We can, and then we're gonna do some fireworks, and have a little fun. See you back at the hub. I'm having to run back because I forgot the Explorer. I've been working so long. Where did I put it? Oh, I took the vehicles off the radar. Okay, where's our Time to finish Fixmas. 500. You better watch out. 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 Fixmas is coming to town. I have broken Ada. Yay, we got a star on our tree. I did all that recording for the factory and I had not actually completed the thing, so the giant trees don't have the star. But that's okay. Let us go back. And then we're going to talk about the flashing lights. Okay. So I know some people know how to do this. And some people are going to be like, how in the world do you have flashing lights? And it's actually a pretty simple thing. I stole this straight up from Dan P. He has a, he does some satisfactory YouTube content. And he posted this earlier in the Fixmas event. And he did it with a Christmas tree. 
and it was like genius. So I totally stole it. I'm gonna quickly explain how I did it, but I'm gonna also leave a link in the description to his original video so you can get a little bit more about how he did it. But for the lights, uh, the setup for it is pretty far away. So I'm gonna go ahead and use the flying mod to help explain this. And I'm also using the flying for doing our fireworks later. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. This just pretty easy allows me to fly. So the lights are actually done via coal generators. It's actually pretty simple. It's just underfed coal generators. And I can go show that over here. You can see I have them over here. So what I did was I, we were only using about 270 coal off that Pure node to power our Nobelisks and the lovely monster over here. So I upped it to 390 and stole 120. And so you see that coal line is being perfectly split among 12 coal generators. So there's no way for that 120 to keep all 12 running. It'll run eight full time, but 12 with a perfect split means that they are occasionally shutting off as they run out of fuel. It's a genius thing. I love what Dan P did. It was an absolute genius move. I had to utilize it. As you see, that one like shut off, that one shut off and they get a piece of fuel. So it's just a perfect splitter, comes in, splits between two and then splits between two, which each one then splits between three. So it's a perfect split among all 12. The water extractors are all running at 75 and at 75%, you can feed two coal generators. These are not underfed for water. I didn't want the water to cause any underfeeding. So they're providing enough water to keep all 12 running. And I just split it up two, 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 two. So they're all running at 75, just made it easy. And then I just run power lines all the way up in a weird, weird way, which we'll remove later. But yeah, just I kept changing how I did it. I was just trying to get it up here. Power line to power line to power line. This one's clipping a little bit, but I was like, eh. And then it's our main power line. And they come up here to our factory. You have 12 lines, see six, six, and this is the main line. Let's go inside. Yeah, I don't use this for anything. It was just a tower for fun. And then they come up here and I put this little box. Let me turn the light on here. Put this little box on and get the lights on. Night mode off. So the box just hides some of the wires and they come down here, clipping through the floor. They all come down to a different light, light meter. So this one's red, green, blue. So each of the 12 lines, so each coal generator has a separate power line running all the way up here and I keep it completely separate and then they just go down the line, all the way down there through the wall, all the way down the wall, all the way down to the outside. And then each one just connects to a light pole. And that's why as the, as the coal generator shuts off, that, that light line comes off, shuts off, turns back on. And I also just decided to add some more. So I ran another one light up here. And that is how I did the blinking lights. And I thought it turned out pretty well. The, from a perspective like this, they show up pretty nicely and they blink. Let's set the time darker again, set time. And at nighttime, they look great. What we're gonna do now is a little bit of fireworks. So let's have some fun. Okay, time for the final show. So I have about 4,000 fireworks sitting all over the Rocky Desert. And we're gonna visit just about every factory that we've built, except maybe the oil factory. So with any luck, this is gonna look great. It's gonna turn out well. If not, eh, we'll see. I'm sure we'll still get a good show. There's no way to oh, redo this. You can't save because if you save and reload, every firework goes off at once. Currently it's bringing my frames per second down to about 20. <laughs> so we're gonna get this thing going. I don't think I would have dropped more, but it has a it's having a huge effect on my frame rate actually. So without further ado, Merry Fixmas, and to the end of this special.
<laughs> I didn't set fireworks over there. So not every firework is going off without a hitch, but you know. And I believe this is our finale. We just auto save <laughs> so long. And that was 4,000 fireworks. It was really long. I hope you enjoyed it. And that ends our Fixmas. We'll return with our main playthrough again in episode 12. And I'll see you next time. And just as a bonus, we're going to load into a save and watch 4,000 fireworks go off at the same time. That was fun. Oh yeah, this is a good shot. See if I can do it real slow. The mouse. I don't have to set up the camera. This would be good. And this way. Oh, what's that? 
Oh, oh no. Where are they? Oh, oh no! So <laughs> they're chasing me! <laughs> they won't stop. They're coming into the air. Oh my goodness, what am I gonna do? I'm in slow flight mode. How do I get out? What am I gonna do? Uh, maybe I can... Uh, quick, 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 switch, switch. Fly fast, fly fast, fly fast, go! Ah! Aha, catch me now. Teach them. 